I've ducked up. Welcome back to the Riverside Woodworks channel. Um, today, we've got a repair on a tabletop. Uh, the customers brought in this table. My job was simply to sand it back and refinish it. Uh, I didn't realize it was veneer. So in this small section here, or not so small section, uh, I've burnt through the veneer. And today you're gonna see me patch that job. All right, so uh, this table looks very close to American oak. So I went and bought a chunk of American oak uh, and I cut a very small credit card size piece, which is what you see here. All right, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna inlay this chunk to cover it up. It's not gonna be a perfect grain match, but I think the color is pretty close. Uh, the next thing I need to do is create a router jig uh, to cut out a pocket uh, to, for this inlay to sit in. All right, what I'm gonna do now is set the router bit depth. I've got a flush trim, top mounted flush trim bit uh, in the router here. What I wanna do is set this as close to the depth as I possibly can. The mortise is now chopped out with a router. I'm gonna use this corner chisel from Narex. I don't know if you can see that. But it's perfectly shaped to cut out the corner. Okay, what you see me doing here off camera, I uh, sanded up some American oak. I've got the sawdust there. Uh, mixing it with Fiddy's filler gel. It works really well. It takes stain and finish very well. So I'm just mixing up and just putting it into those hairline cracks uh, that you see just around the key. Just Hopefully I just blend it in uh, seamlessly with the wood around it. All right, crisis averted. So we started off with a big gash in the, uh, the table here. Uh, we routed it out a pocket for this little card that we put in and I think with some finish this is going to blend in really well. Thanks for watching.